hey, it's the Terminian Hero here, and in this video, uh, we are gonna do Road Crash again. Just kidding. Or am I? Let's get ready to race. Why? Cause I'm crazy. Uh -huh. Come on, Crash. You can beat these guys again for absolutely no reason. But you're not going to. Let's go. Hey look, a sign with an alien face. And we are in another level. I think it's called like Hot Coco or something like that. Uh, that clock will start a time trial, and I'm not gonna pick it up, but if you're playing along, I recommend that you do, purely because, well, first of all, this is a secret level, and in secret levels, you pretty much automatically, um, get the, uh, get the platinum relic when you do the time trial, and look, the finish is right where the start is. But we're gonna try to get the gem here. There's, uh, there, in this game you can actually get to 105%. And the way you get that extra 5% is by collecting five secret gems. Uh, there's two secret levels in the game. Oops. Uh, there's two secret levels in the game each of which have two gems, uh, one for, like, finding the gem, and one for getting all the crates. And then the other secret gem in the game is automatically rewarded to you once you've gotten either a gold or platinum relic on every level. And that's how you get 105%. Okay, we made that jump this time. Good. I'm not really sure how to explore this place. I'm not sure if there's checkpoints. I hope there is, because I'm apparently not that good. There's a checkpoint. Let's not get it yet. Let's get the checkpoint! Okay. Because everything around me is scary. How do I even do that? Also, how did Coco even get here? It was clearly Crash that went through that. Well, the time warp clearly went back to the time twister, or whatever it's called. So... There's also gonna be a crate in here that destroys all the nitro, so maybe I should get that before going for that crate. And I'm pretty sure this is just, like, a wide-open level, too. Uh, but the ramp is going this way, so I say we go around this way. You know, follow the, the actual direction of the ramps. I'm just kind of lost here, because I don't know where to go, and I don't want to miss anything. And I just don't want to die, because if I do die, then I have to get everything that I got after the last checkpoint again. And there's no way I would remember what I have and haven't got. <laughs> uh, got a little... Uh, it's, it's like in those driving tests where you have to go around the cones, except in here the cones are bombs. 
which is a much scarier driving test than the actual driving test. I wish I would have put that up sooner so I would have seen how much nitro was in this level. Oh, that was so close. Oh my gosh. I was kind of hoping there would be more nitro in the level because I, I hit that thing and I've still got so many crates to get. Which really isn't a bad thing. This crate is underwater, so it's it's going to be fun getting that one. <laughs> you know what? Let We've got three ramps in a row here. Let's... There's also that one. I'm gonna ignore that one for now. Just because it scares me. Oh, I, that didn't work. That was supposed to work. But it didn't. This one scares me too! It has been forever since I got a checkpoint. Oh my gosh. I am terrible with these jumps for some reason. I don't know why. Alright, where was that? Oh, there's a shark. That's not very pleasant. So, where was that... Uh, green exclamation mark crate again? Not sure. I would really like to get it as soon as possible. That crate looked like it was washed up on the shore. It's too bad blowing up all the nitro doesn't also blow up all these bombs. Just like a massive detonation switch for all of the explosives in this level. Did I just see a checkpoint? Heck yeah, I'm getting that. That also makes me feel like I passed the... the crate that destroys all the nitro. I mean, especially considering I didn't see that shark before. How would I have passed it? I am so lost. Oh, here's that swervy driver... That, like, driver's test of death thing. <laughs> driver's test of death. Alright, here's the crate I was looking for. Oh man, that bomb moves really fast, and I didn't even get to get blown up by it, because I got blown up by the nitro that I was trying to blow up in a very, by, you know, a safe means. If I would have finished my jump, I would have blown it up in a safe means. Get those crates around there. This level has turned this game into a collectathon, and I like it. I love me a collectathon. Don't hit that bomb. Just wanted to get that crate before I came and got this checkpoint. Okay, there's that underwater crate again. Let's go all the way back here and get these two while we're at it. And is there... No, there's not anything behind that, because that would be behind the boundaries. I see a shark to the left there. No! That didn't work as I'd hoped. Okay, so there's all those ramps again. But I'm sure I have to collect some other stuff again. No, because I got that. Okay. So it's just these that I've got to collect again. That's fine. Oh, we'll go say hi to the shark while we're here. Or the bombs. 
that's fine too. Like, let's just get this dangerous stuff out of the way right now. dangerous thing here. Oh, we've only got 20 crates to go! Okay, I made it. Now let's just go here. Get that one under the water. Okay, I got it. You gotta land hard enough on the water to be able to get that crate. And then I missed one crate at the end here. that ramp, there's some crates by these bombs, which I will of course go for now. Hmm. Man, there are just bombs everywhere, but it's a secret level, so they gotta make it hard. Okay, I'm alive. And I got the crates, so it's all good. Oh, I almost sped a little too fast there. And there's a checkpoint. Good. A checkpoint right by a shark. Yeah, that was gonna happen. But I just got the checkpoint. Still right by the shark, which bothers me. Why would you put a checkpoint right by a shark? He's gonna spawn camp me or something. Okay, this is that crate from earlier that was blocked by that nitro in midair. And now there's three more crates somewhere. I said we have to find a gem somewhere in this level. I don't actually think we do now that I'm looking at it. I think you just get a gem for actually beating the level. And the finish was blocked off by Nitro before, so we had to go find that green exclamation crate. Ooh. Uh, yes, that is the rest of the crates we need, so let's get out of here. And I get a gem for this, right? Only one gem in that level. I'm confused as far as 105% goes. I thought that's how you got 105%. Maybe just beating the level counts as part of it, or perhaps the relic does? The reason I didn't get the relic on that level was because I'm gonna be doing videos without commentary later where I get all of the relics. But, uh, you could do that right away since you basically automatically get the relic. Like, you don't have to, you really don't have to worry about how long you take. But, when you die during a time trial, you have to do the whole level over again. So, that could be a problem. Like, th there are no checkpoints in time trial mode. Anyways, that level actually took us quite a while, so that's gonna be all we do in this video. In the next video, 
we will be going to double header. I'm the Terminian Hero, and I will see you then.